What's up you guys? Welcome back. Today's video is going to be my pamper routine. I like to incorporate this every few weeks or so as a little pick-me-up, just a little treat for myself. Normally I like to do my pamper routines at the end of my evening when I've already completed my workout for the day. So now we're going to head over to the kitchen and whip up some DIY face masks and hair masks. All you need for this hair mask is one ripe banana, a ripe avocado, and a teaspoon of olive oil. Just adjust to your hair length and also with the thickness of your hair. So basically you just want to place everything into a blender. You don't want to mash this up. Make sure you blend it well because when you rinse this product out of your hair, you don't want it to kind of clog up your drain. So just pour all the ingredients, blend it up until you get a nice smooth consistency. For the face mask, you want to use half of a ripe avocado, half teaspoon of freshly squeezed lemon juice, and one tablespoon of raw honey. So you first want to mash up the avocado with the back of a spoon or a fork. Make sure you mash it up fairly well, then add the lemon juice as well as the honey. And then just stir all of the ingredients together. Our hair and face mask are ready to go and that took us under 10 minutes to whip up. Now since I was sweating profusely during my workout, I want to make sure my face is clean. So I'm just going to rinse it off with lukewarm water. Now for the hair mask. This is such an amazing hair mask. Super inexpensive. So some of the benefits of this DIY avocado banana hair mask. Number one is that avocado is excellent for hair repair, especially if you have dry damaged hair, which I have. It also helps promote shine as well as hair growth. The olive oil is extremely hydrating. It protects your hair from damage. And bananas, which are rich in potassium, help soften the hair as well as prevent split ends and breakage. And as you guys can see here, I'm basically just coating from the roots all the way to the ends of my hair. And then I'm going to apply a shower cap just to make sure it doesn't drip anywhere. So now we're going to apply the DIY face mask. Some of the benefits, number one is the avocado is an antioxidant to help keep your skin smooth. The lemon, which is a natural astringent, which helps to brighten the skin and the honey, which is moisturizing and it can also help brighten the skin. So we're going to leave these masks on for about 25 to 30 minutes. And now we're going to move on to the legs. Every now and then I like to treat myself and use the NADS ultra smoothing exfoliating wax strips, which are infused with pomegranate and pink grapefruit which is excellent for sensitive skin because I do have sensitive skin. This is in collaboration with NADS. Something that's important to note is you want to make sure that your skin is free of any oils, any moisturizers, any lotions. So you're going to take the coarse side of the exfoliating strip and you're going to just rub this in circular motions on your legs. This will help prepare your legs for the wax strip and it will also exfoliate any dead skin. Now you want to rub the wax strip together. This will actually help melt the wax that's in between the strips and then just pull the two strip pieces apart very slowly. So you want to smooth over the strip three to four times in the direction of your hair growth. Hold your skin taut and then pull back the strip quickly and your skin will feel super smooth. It will remove the hair in that area wherever you place the strip. This was actually not painful at all. I was super surprised and it left my skin feeling so smooth. I especially liked using this on my knee area. That's where I have a lot of trouble shaving. Now the great thing about the NADS wax strips is that you can use these repeatedly. All you have to do is just fold it in half, warm up the strip with the warmth of your hand and you can keep using it until the strip is no longer effective. Once finished, you want to open one of the post wax oil wipes which will soothe your skin and minimize any irritation and this will also remove any wax residue. As you can see from the strips, it removed all of the hair and left my legs feeling nice and smooth and soft and now I don't have to shave 
for a couple of weeks since it removed the hair from the root. So now I'm gonna jump in the shower, rinse off the face mask, and shampoo my hair thoroughly to get rid of any of the avocado residue and banana residue. And now I can finally just relax and get some work done on my MacBook. This is the time when I like to just go through my emails and also edit any videos that I have that are pending. So I hope you guys enjoyed my pamper routine. I hope you guys found this video helpful. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you smash that like button as well as don't forget to hit the subscribe button and follow me on my social media. Hit that bell notification to be notified of new uploads. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys check out the videos over here on the side. You guys might enjoy those as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Thank you.